to my channel today my Nordstrom orders have arrived <laughs> I telling you I purchased my stuff during early access today's 27th I finally got the last package I mean I got packages yesterday I got packages today I don't understand why it took two weeks for me to get my stuff but you know what it's here I'm glad um I picked up a few things I think I did pretty well this year I have a Nordstrom card solely for the anniversary sale of course I end up spending it all year long but you know I always make sure it's paid off during the anniversary sale or before it starts that way I can use it last year I maxed my card out during the sale I was like I am not doing that this time so I really didn't spend much I'm quite proud of myself I think I spent $400 and I know for a fact a hundred of it's going back if not more and I don't know I haven't tried it on this stuff's not been tried on it's not been worn it like I said some of it just arrived today, some of it arrived yesterday. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up these boxes. We're going to try the stuff on. We're going to see if it fits, if I like it, if I don't like it, if I want to send it back, if I want to keep it. And you guys are going to help me. So, yeah, that's it. If you guys want to see what I purchased during the anniversary sale, hey, keep watching. Okay, guys, I am going to show you what I picked up. I will tell you what I paid for it sale price what's well, going to be regular price and then afterwards at the end we will do a try on okay so hey let's just jump into this first off you guys i've showed you the bag the rebecca minkoff uh what is this called i don't know what it's called but it is the new bag it is really long this is actually like i said i just unboxed this this is what the strap looks like i know there's on this side there is a oh yeah see it's adjustable I love Rebecca Minkoff's bags but this is $159.90 and then after the sale it's going to be $245 like stop and you open it up like I haven't even took nothing out of it yet so I think it's going to be pretty good size if you know Rebecca Minkoff bags they're either really big or they're really small so I think once you take that was full paper and everything, you take everything out of it, it's gonna be pretty roomy. So yeah, I'm like super you guys, I am so stoked about this bag. I got it in it's called New Gray. I think that this shade is sold out, but they still have it in black. But I really like this. Look at the, the stud details there. But not pretty. Look at that. Oh, and again after the sale it's called the Darren small feed bag color is new gray and it will be two hundred and forty five dollars now this is the one that I picked up last year it is just the um, backpack and guys I have carried this like every day since I purchased it last year during the anniversary sale love it so I'm just like one you guys know I love gray so I mean I think this is going to be this is a keeper <laughs> this is a keeper for sure and then I picked up some sh booties now I ordered a pair of these and then I instantly was like oh my god I ordered the wrong color so I went back in to order the right color I even called Nordstrom because I just placed the order to see if I could cancel it. They wouldn't even let me cancel it. Like, seriously. I'm like, are you kidding me? And then, two weeks later, they finally sent me the booties. But these are the Vince Camudos. These are so cute. My favorite thing about the anniversary sale is always the booties. I mean, I'm obsessed. But look at these. Seriously? Oh my god, these are gorgeous. Wow, look at this. Look at the detail in there. And see, this is the actual color that I wanted because it's almost like a hint of gray. It's called Foxy Suede. But it's 
almost like gray. And the heel's not big, which I like because I like my booties to be really like flat. So I'm so excited for these. Oh my gosh, you guys, you don't even know. And the first pair that I had ordered, like I said, I ordered the wrong color. As far as they weren't the color that I wanted, I... And I'm glad that I reordered because these are too dark. See, these are gray also. These are called graystone. They are too gray. You know what I'm saying? I really like this one. See the difference? I like this one. I think this one's going to look better with jeans. But, yeah. We'll see when we do the try-on. So, I ordered those. And these are $99.90. And after the sale, they go up to $149.95. That is why I order boots during the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale. Because I am such a shoe fanatic. Oh, my gosh. I love shoes. I love tennis shoes. I love boots. I love booty. I love booties. Just everything. I'm such a sucker for a good shoe. And every year, that's what I'll buy. Booties in a bag. So, now, let's get into some clothing. You guys, I only bought four pieces of clothing. But let me show you what I did get. I got this BP rib cardigan. This is what it looks like. It kind of has that free people vibe to it. I got it for... I paid $25.90 for it. I don't know how much it is after the sale. I do know that right now it is sold out. I like how thin it is. And like the edges of the sleeve are like a raw edge. But, oh my gosh, you guys. And this is actually a cardigan, okay? So you can actually unbutton it and wear it as a cardigan. Now, I sized up on this. I bought an extra large because I listened to everybody on YouTube talk about it. And I said to definitely size up. So I did. I love this. I can't wait to try it on. I'm so excited. Okay. Then I picked up one of these BP... Raw edge tees. This is the scoop neck long sleeve. So I picked this one up. It was $18.90. And then after the sale, I think it's $29. But I love striped shirts. You guys know I love striped shirts. I have so many black and white striped shirts that I did not need another one. But I got that. And then I picked up the short sleeve v-neck one this was $11.90 and after the sale it's $19 but look at the color this is what I like is the color it's kind of like that oh it's just a really deep coppery color but so I picked that up and then the last thing that I picked up and then we'll jump into the try on you guys oh, oh, I love this even Kevin liked this and I was shocked I was really shocked but he was like I think you might have to dry clean that and he is right it is dry cleaned only but this is thread and supply it was $58.90 and afterwards will be $88 but it is the Brandon fleece jacket you guys oh Look at this. The inside of it is made out of t-shirt material. Like, seriously. And look at this. This Look at that. Oh, does that not look like a big old bed of cotton? Holy shit. This is so soft. Ah, I am excited. Look at the inside of it. It's like t-shirt material. But I looked... When he said that and it is dry clean only so i don't know should i keep it i think i should keep it because it just feels so good okay guys now i'm gonna try it all on for you 
Okay guys, this is the raw edged v-neck tee that is like by BP for eleven ninety, I believe. Um, I mean, look at this shade. It's a shade not so pretty. It is really low cut. I mean, you kind of might want to wear something under it if you get it oversized. But if not, I mean, I think it'd be great. But look how long it is. See how long it is. It covers the bum. And so you can wear it like that. You can knot it. You can just kind of tuck her in and wear it like this. I just think it's super cute. But I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with the shade of this. This, I think the color is so pretty. So I'm definitely, definitely, definitely keeping this. This is a keeper for sure. I love it. Okay, here's that same shirt, but in long sleeve. Um, I don't think I like this one. I don't know. It's just not as, I don't know, comfy as the short sleeve one. Um, it's cute. But I don't know if it's, I don't know. What do you guys think? I kind of like it, but... You know, I like my shirts to be comfy, and this kind of, maybe it just needs wash to be more comfortable, to be just, it's soft, but I think it could be softer, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, what do you guys think about this one? And it is just, it's long like the other one. So, and I like how the sleeves, you know, they get in my hands. What do you think? Hey, I don't know. Okay, guys, here is the other BP shirt. Look how comfy looking this is. And like I said, it's actually a cardigan. But I've seen everybody wearing it as a shirt. And let me show you. You can wear it loose like this. Or you can tuck it in. Which... You know, that's just a, a quick duck in one-handed. You could, you know, tuck it in. Let's see. I hear helicopters outside. Like that. Or you can knot it like this. I see a lot of people knotting it, and I actually do like it knotted. A lot, actually. I think that's really cute knotted. And, okay, these are the two shades of the boots. The We have the Greystone. And then we have like foxy suede, which I think is a pretty light gray. But look how easy these go on. I mean, it's just like boom, boom, on. Now you guys are going to tell me which color you like. I think I like the foxy suede. What do you think? Are they not flipping adorable? Look at that. Love these flipping boots. Look at this. cute and I like them with the short pants look at that how cute are these boots now these are the foxy suede and these are the gray stuff I don't yeah I don't like the dark gray ones I like these right here, but ah, I love that little groove into the down the side of the boot that shows your ankle. I mean, look at that. Is that not cute? Love it. So, what do you think? Are these a keeper or should I send them both back? You guys tell me. Okay, now we have the bag. What do you guys think of this bag? I think it's worth keeping. I really, I really like it. Because I just like Rebecca Minkoff bags. And I love how it's a crossbody. And I can actually carry it and hold it like this. That's super cute. I'm not good at holding this camera. 
with a mirror in front of me or I could carry it like this which that rarely happens I'm more of a cross the body bag but it's a just I just really really like this bag I mean but there's your full view but look at that bag isn't that bag nice right there Mountain Dew babes Mountain Dew if I could get rid of that that's gonna help me out a lot you guys because I have lost like 13 pounds now but I have whoop, 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 I have that that I need to um, get rid of so if anybody would like to join me on this diet thing I would be glad to have some support yeah, definitely like definitely but yeah now, I didn't buy no jeans this year this is the first year like I bought jeans last year but this year I actually bought all my jeans like I like these are brand new too I bought these at Abercrombie I love these I saw the tag on them right here because I haven't took the tag off yet because I'm gonna do an Abercrombie haul and I know most people are like, ah, you're Charles Dor our Rombie. Ah, uh, yeah, whatever. I don't care. I can get my ass in them. I'm going to wear them. But this bag. <gasps> oh, I really like this bag, you guys. I really like this bag. What do you think? Yes? No? Thumbs up? Yes. Oh, my God, you guys. Look at this coat. Are you kidding me? <gasps> I love this. Look at that. That's t-shirt material in there. Uh, I don't care if it's um, dry clean only or not. Look at this. <gasps> Ooh, I feel like a teddy bear. You know what I'm saying? This is so flipping nice. <gasps> um, what do you think? Keep or go? I'm thinking keep. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking keep. I don't know. What do you think? It's so, it's so nice. And it's not so boxy on me. I thought it would be boxy. But it's not. It's just, <laughs> oh my God. I need a robe that's made out of this with t-shirt material on the inside and fluffy on the outside. I mean, look at this. Do you see that? How it looks like cotton? Oh my gosh. And then look at this. It's like a knit material. This thing is amazing. Oh my god. Now I went up a size on this too. This is an extra large. Because I wanted to be able to wear my sweaters underneath it. And I definitely have plenty of room. Look at this. Whoops. To wear my sweaters under it but it's still even though it's big it's just mm, it's comfy it's comfy you guys it's comfy god i love this coat yeah this is staying with mama what do you think up down what do you think yes no i'm keeping it regardless but i still want to know what your thoughts are so what do you think oh, i'm obsessed look at this Love it. Love it. Okay, you guys. <laughs> Trying these clothes on in an upstairs room with the air conditioner off is brutal. Brutal, I'm telling you. But you guys, if you enjoy fashion videos, please give this video a thumbs up. If you like me showing you how to get great fashion at an inexpensive price let me know below also um did you pick up anything at the nordstrom sale um if you did what did you get what do you think about the items i got should i keep some of them should i send some of them back should i keep them all i think i'm keeping the coat for sure and i'm pretty positive that i'm keeping the purse because oh, I love me a Rebecca Minkoff bag, guys. But I'm just not one that... I know a lot of people are putting up Nordstrom videos. And they're buying the $100 final shirts. No. 
even though it's regular $149, at $100, it's still way too much for me. Yeah, I'll just go to Walmart and get me a $8 men's flannel. <laughs> but you guys, that's it. That's everything that I have for you. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you are new to my channel, hit that red subscribe button below. You're the first ones to know every time I post a new video. But my arm is killing me holding this camera up. So I'm going to let you go. I'm going to get my shorts back on. I love you guys. And I'll talk to y'all in my next video. Bye, guys.